remember just a little bit ago when we were talking about Ben Shapiro? Do you remember that? Pepper's Farm remembers. Do you remember when he was talking about the left wanting to control your life and 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 you know harassing you and trying to get you fired and coming to your home and threatening you and all that? Remember all that? Remember how the left does that? Remember? Not like this though. This is different. Not like this. This is harassment at all, right? Because this woman whistle blew on the Department of Health and them lying about the COVID numbers, right? This is harassment. This is a Gestapo shit, right? Like, this isn't almost like tantamount to like black bag and her and her family, right? Totally normal thing. Just pull guns on your kids in the middle of the day, raid your house and This is a Florida man story, but not in the sense of a regular Florida man story, specifically the governor of Florida, Ron DeSantis. So uh, Ron DeSantis is a human being. We'll say that that is not a nice person and does not have the best entrance of his constituency in mind at any point. So a woman who worked for Florida's um, health organization, um, I think it's like the, the state's health org or whatever. Um, she was a whistleblower and was talking about how Florida's COVID numbers were actually deflated from what they actually were and she was trying to get that information out there they harassed and bullied her and i don't know if they made her step down or she was fired one of the two but a lot of this shit happened back in may so fast forward to now the governor had the cops raid her house because they suspected she was using a laptop there to hack into the state's health records or something like raided her house yo like pulled guns on her kids because she was exposing the fact that they were lying about their fucking infection numbers An American citizen. This is Gestapo shit. Like, just watch this fucking shit. Come outside. Outside. Who else is in the house, ma'am? My two children and my husband. Where's your husband at? Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. You want the children now? Calm all down. Mr. Jones, after come after, down after she says you want yeah. the children to come down, he pulls his gun out. Like, it, this is broad daylight. Like, 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 what the fuck do they think is going to happen right now? Police, come down now. Sir, Bring your down. children. Down. My children. Oh, hang on, let me clear my house. He just pointed a gun at my children. Search warrant. So, after this bullshit happened, um, the, um, um, one of the, um, people who, who, okay, stop this shit. Um, one of the people who like, like appoints, um, like does like judicial appointments, like for the state, he resigned because he was so upset about this shit. So, um, uh, his name is Ron Filipowski, uh, announced his resignation from the 12th, uh, circuit judicial nomination commission on Twitter on Tuesday, saying a raid at the home of Rebecca Jones was unconscionable Jones who designed, or I'm sorry, Jones who, uh, designed and managed the Florida department of health's coronavirus dashboard was fired. Okay. She was fired. Um, in may at the time, Jones said that she believed it was because she was too transparent. Governor Ron DeSantis, however, called Jones insubordinate. I no longer wish to serve the current government of Florida in any capacity, Filipowski said in his resignation letter. Agents with the Florida Department of Law Enforcement served the search warrant Monday, saying a computer at Jones's home was used to hack the Department of Health. Filipowski, a Republican, has been a vocal opponent of President Trump who is a close DeSantis ally. He served on the commission that recommends judicial nominees for Sarasota, 
Manatee, and DeSoto counties. So, remember just a little bit ago when we were talking about Ben Shapiro? Do you remember that? Pepper's Farm remembers. Do you remember when he was talking about the left wanting to control your life and, 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 you know, harassing you and trying to get you fired and coming to your home and threatening you and all that shit? Remember all that? Remember how the left does that? Remember? Not like this, though. This is different. Not like this. This is harassment at all. Right? Because this woman fucking whistle blew on the Department of Health and them lying about the fucking COVID numbers, right? This is harassment. This is a Gestapo shit, right? Like, this isn't almost like tantamount to like black bagging her and her fucking family, right? Totally normal thing. Just pull guns on your kids in the middle of the day, raid your house and shit. Now, imagine, imagine if this would have turned out like the Breonna Taylor incident and then everybody in that house ended up dead. Think about how the blowback would be from that. Think about this, this, this all white, you know, uh, middle-class suburban family, somebody who was a government worker murdered by police in their own home during a botched raid. Oh man. Crazy, crazy. But the left, Hey, the left, hey, hey, you know, we're trying to control your lives, guys. You know, if you step out of line and say something the left doesn't like, we'll destroy you. Yep, just like Ben says. Just like Ben says. Mmm. Mmm, mm mmm. Uh, perhaps instead of arguing with the right wing public, point out that left wing causes have been hijacked by right wing power brokers to push their agendas and that both Republicans and Democrats are right wing. Well. Um, I wouldn't say right wing power brokers. Like, 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 like what, what do you mean by that? Like corporations? Well, first off, I'm not sure what any of that has to do with this, but um, because this is a, I mean, solidified, like, on video example of Republicans abusing their power and shutting down political dissent using the state. Like, that's them doing it right now. Do you know the shit that they keep saying? You know, we're going to throw you in the gulags. If we catch you kissing your wife without a mask on, sleeping in the same bed and all that shit. Remember that? That's 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 what we're talking about. That right there. Oh shit, what the fuck? Outside. Why did that restart? Who else is in the house, I fucking hate when it does that shit. It scared the fucking shit out of me. Yeah, yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Yes, one is a death cult, the other isn't. Agreed. Agreed. 